Hey guys, how's it going? I recently traveled to Panama City, Florida to photograph none other than Dale Comstock, American Badass, and his beautiful wife, Miroslava. I got some amazing photos of them from my new book, We the People, coming out later this fall. And after we did the photos, I asked Dale why he thinks the AR-15 platform is the perfect weapon for home self-defense. Check it out. Hi, my name is Dale Comstock. Um, I'm the author of American Badass. My background, uh, I'm a retired Army. I spent uh, almost 10 years in the Delta Force as a Delta Force operator, five years as a Green Beret, uh, light and heavy weapons expert, and about four years in 82nd as a long range reconnaissance scout. Um, and then of course I worked about another nine and a half years for the government as a paramilitary uh, operative. Um, what I want to talk about real quick is weapons and uh, kind of my perspective on it. First of all, I think of weapons um, and firearms training as martial arts in its deadliest form. Um, it's an extreme form of self-defense and uh, you know, there's obviously a place for it. Um, with that said, a couple years ago I was on a business trip and uh, I had an intruder break in the house late at night, uh, about 10.30 I guess when my wife was home alone and uh, she was actually taking a shower and she knew that someone came through the garage door or laundry door based on an audible alarm that we have in the house. Um, interestingly, right before we, I actually went on this business trip, the night before we left, or I left, I actually went and rehearsed with my wife on the use of the firearms uh, for the house and uh, for self-defense. So we had, she had options. She had uh, pistols to pick from, a shotgun, and she also had this particular weapon, uh, which is an AR-15. As you can see, it's pretty much set up with two double stack uh, magazines, um, 60 rounds. It's got um, an adjunct aiming system on it. It's got uh, um, gun light on it. It actually had a laser on it at the same time as well. And it's set up so, that, you know, obviously it's an instrument for, uh, for killing. And, uh, and it was set up for her and for home self-defense. So anyway, she basically jumped out of the shower, um, literally didn't even dry off or get dressed, called me on the cell phone, grabbed this particular weapon, and then uh, moved to the second uh, story landing in the house and uh, took up a defensive uh, firing position. About that time, and I was on the phone with her, um, the guy actually rounded the corner coming down the hallway and uh, started around the corner when I heard her yell over the phone, um, stop, I have a gun and I'll shoot your head off. And literally those were her words. Um, and the guy turned around, ran out the door, ran out the garage door. Um, she ran actually to the, my daughter's room, made sure she was okay, came down the stairs and followed him out the garage. And by the time she got to the garage door, he had actually already uh, activated the garage door, opened and closed the garage behind him. Um, and then she reactivated the door, brought it back up, and by that time he was gone. Um, that was the first incident. About two weeks later, he came back again, uh, about 5.30 in the afternoon, tried to come through the two double doors behind me that were chained. Um, the chain stopped him long enough where she could go back, grab the weapon, and then again, uh, uh, prepare to engage the guys as he's coming through the door. As he started to crack the door, apparently he saw her, ran, jumped in the car and got away for the second time. So to this day, we don't know who he was, uh, what his intent was, but I'm sure it was not good. Um, he had to know that I wasn't around um, for him to do something like that. So, um, you know, and people ask me all the time, well, why, you know, an AR-15 versus um, a shotgun or a handgun? And, uh, you know, they're, they're all tools and, you know, Considering uh, you know the layout of the house, uh, my wife's skill level um, using firearms, um, for me, uh, I felt that uh, the AR-15 was a better choice, and uh, I can go through a hundred reasons why I think it's better than a pistol or a shotgun in this particular scenario. And uh, and since that time, what I've done is actually developed uh, and conceptualized another AR-15 platform for women for home self-defense, which now she actually uh, has her name on it. Um, Call the Lady Spartan, and it's designed for women for that purpose um, because I do believe it's a better option than a handgun um, and definitely a shotgun because you know those both those weapon systems have limitations in terms of uh, um, uh, target acquisition as well as um, you know the amount of ammunition that you can, uh, for example, a shotgun you can six or seven rounds and then that's it. Um, so. Um, that was kind of my story, but at the end of the day, you know, it's my wife's story, and uh, and again, it's you know what I want to do is let people out to know that, you know, assault rifles and firearms are not just to protect us from a tyrannical government, although that's why the Second Amendment was um, established, um, and firearms are not just for hunting; um, they do have a purpose, and I can, you know, I believe that in my heart, um, this particular weapon that night and on that on the second day, um, probably saved my wife from. Um, at least being raped, maybe murdered, uh, maybe saved my daughter's life, um, you know, and this was the one thing that I feel like my wife was confident to use 
to defend my house and my family, and uh, she did it effectively. So, um, you know, again, you know, she had options, and uh, the AR-15 was her option. I think it was the right option. We had a really good time hanging out with Dale and Miroslava today. You should go check out Dale's book, American Badass. I've read it, it's great, it's entertaining, it's engaging, and it's got a lot to teach us, especially us guys in this day and age. Dale is a modern day butt kicking warrior. Stay tuned to guns.com for more amazing stuff and go on Facebook and like my book's page, We the People Book. You can see a lot more photos such as this. Well, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you really soon.